So good evening ladies and gentlemen, this is a Whoopi speaking and uh, tonight uh, after all my reflection on all this shorting coil, pendulum motor uh, and a lot of other posts, I think uh, it is probably good and very interesting uh, as I looked at the Rosemary Ainley a new experiment at Over Unity Forum. It was a reply number 208 from Mag Bluvin, which explains small circuits and a quite interesting in experiment to do. As you can see, it is a battery, a switch, a diode, an inductor and a capacitor okay and what Mike Lubin said that if you switch on here on these circuits you get more voltage in the cap as in the battery this due to the inductor Okay, now we go to the system here. So, you have a battery, it is a 4.5 volt, as this multimeter shows. It goes in series to a diode here, which goes in series to the inductor. For the inductor, I took the primary of a microwave oven transformer. All the rest is nothing, it's not connecting. Only the primary to get a very high inductance. And as you can see, it is only 2 ohm resistance and 220 millihenry inductance. So it is a ratio of 1 to 100. I think it is very important, you will see after why. And then a capacitor. This capacitor is a 12 microfarad. I don't know exactly the, the voltage, but it, doesn't, it is for, made for a, a normal uh, AC motor. Okay? Now, the first thing we will see here, I go on the scope, and on the scope, I will go down here to basis on 2 volts. You see, 2 volts. Okay. And now, first of all, we check if McGlewin uh, is alright. So, I simply connect the plus to the plus of the battery. So, the capacitor is now zero. Okay. So I do it and up connected. And what is the capacitor now? The capacitor is almost two, four, six, almost seven volts going slowly down. So my gluing seems to be right. Okay. Very interesting. But now it is connected. Okay? the diod and I found another interesting result now I will go much higher I will go to 50 volt per division okay and now I will make an experiment I will short the capacitor check like this okay and we will see what happened on the oscilloscope. Okay. I show you on the capacitor what I do. Tac! I short. I did short. As you can see, on the capacitor, we are now more than 100 volts. With this small battery. And if I short now the time, look at it. Poof! 
and the capacitor is not only down, it come back up. We go now another time. Tack, tack. And now we reshort. Puff. I short. D short. Tack. And look at what happened on the oscilloscope. How we do it? Hop. Tack. Goes up. And I short. And I short. Woohoo! Very interesting, isn't it? Put it down, tack, and short now. Puff! Tack, and short. Hop! You see? It is very interesting. I don't know why it is going so hard. It is probably something with back MF, but we are taking very high impulse for a very small battery okay and the battery is always 4.5 volts okay ladies and gentlemen I don't know if it helps but good night at all anyway thanks for watching